Welcome back to Wildflowers YouTube channel. Today we are doing a style challenge <laughs> in honor of our new cases. Uh, Lil Devil and Lil Angel. Uh, this is awkward. <laughs> One moment. <laughs> there we go. Okay, Lil Devil and Lil Angel. I styled Devin um, with my Lil Angel as the inspo and Devin styled me with the little devil as inspo, and she doesn't know what I picked out, and I don't know what she picked out. So, so we're gonna find out. Let's do it. Today, I'm styling my sister in my closet. I'm gonna style Devin based on the angel case, and she's gonna style me based on the devil case. These were chosen randomly. We rock, paper, scissors, and we can even do that, so we flipped a coin. That's how we came to this. I didn't think about this before I should've. So let's see what I do. I wanted to like match the case a little bit, but also be like angelic. What this little character would wear if they were in my closet. I kind of immediately was thinking like flowy, light colors, but also I want Devin to like, like it and be something that she would wear. I'm gonna style her based on like my style and then she'll do the same for her. So this is more like what I would wear as an angel, but I'm gonna put it on her. There's a lot of polka dots in here. Okay, wait, I actually have a dress that's on this rack that I think would be really cute. Devin and I are both really into polka dots right now. But this is so cute. I kind of think it would be cute with this. And this is very my current style situation. I think this would be really cute. I actually haven't even worn this dress yet. And Devin and I always, when we were younger, were like, you can only borrow things if we've worn it already, or if you've worn it like once or twice. And I haven't worn this yet, so we're growing up. <laughs> I'm laying out the options. There's definitely items in here that are Devin's that I've stolen. And I know she has things of mine because she'll send me a photo and I'm like, those are mine. You know what, actually, she had these Chanel shoes of mine for years and didn't tell me. And I was like, I remember I got these so long ago. And I texted her asking if she knew where she, they were and she sent me a photo of them in her closet. And I was like, those are mine. So I finally got them back and I've been wearing them a lot. Um, Devin also got me these for Christmas these Bottega heels, and I love them a lot. Very nice sister award. Do I have anything of Devin's? Probably, she's gonna get mad though if she sees. Devin's style has inspired me a lot, especially like growing up having an older sister, like you think everything they do is cool and cooler than you and you wanna like dress like them and everything. She took so many risks and chances with outfits and clothes and I was like, oh my God, she's so crazy. How did she think of that? How did she put these things together? So then when I started like shopping for myself and buying clothes, I was like getting more pattern things or more like things that I would see her put together and never would think to do in my head. Devin has always been like a pattern girl, like, polka dots, plaids, and she'll put it with like other patterns. The way she, her mind works with clothes is like insane. If I do a red bag, then what color shoe? Actually, these are like blue. I actually thought these were black when I bought them and then they arrived and I realized they were blue. These are cute. What about flats? I oh, look how cute these ballet flats are. I ordered them from this girl, like handmade them in Australia, and I thought they were gonna be like wearable, like flats like this, but they're actual ballet shoes. So I don't know if I can wear them out like I planned, but they're really cute and special still, so. So Devin has influenced me to wear leopard. Her and my mom have always been very big leopard fans, like with everything, home decor, clothing, anything you can imagine. What about this big bag? I actually think Devin has this and she uses it a lot, so I know she'll like it. Oh, I have to give her earrings. Look, here we go like this. This is how I look at all my earrings. Earrings. I really got into earrings, I think this past year. Like I decided I need them for every occasion. I need every chunky earring possible. Like, look at how cute these little gingerbread men are I got around Christmas. Okay, for Devin, 
feel like these hearts could be cute. Little red hearts. I also got like, look at how cute the strawberries are. Like that vibe. For Devin, I think it's done. Perfect, I think this is done. I hope this looks good on and I hope she appreciates that. I've never won this before. So it's extra special for Devin. <laughs> My turn, I mean her turn for me. Speaking of angel and devil, these cases were, I guess, secretly inspired by my tattoos <laughs> that I am now getting removed, but that's okay because now they can live on these two new cases and not on my body. <laughs> I actually really loved them when I got them, but over the years, I just, you know, decided I didn't want any tattoos, honestly. So they are going, but they're forever with me because they're not ever gonna go away fully, so. My style has definitely evolved over the years and that's okay. I look back at photos, honestly, every year. It's like a completely different era, but currently I'm in, which I think has stayed the longest, an era of just like simple, nice fitting, you know, clean looking things because it makes me feel good. I used to wear a lot of things that like I felt like they were one-time wears, like you would wear it and then it was just kind of so insane that I was like, I don't think I would wear this again. I know that there's a lot of shit in here, but I'd rather have less like nicer quality items that I want to wear all the time rather than like one-time wears and then I don't love it. I'm packing this up. So it's gonna be a surprise and she'll like pick hers out and then hide it and then we'll just hand it to each other and get dressed and I hope she likes it. See you at Devon's. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna style my sister with the devil case. This is my inspo. Sydney, can you like go outside? Cause I'm gonna like talk. <laughs> okay, she can't hear me. Part of me was thinking like all black but I think I'm gonna do red. We'll see. So I have these pants and I think I wore them or something or Sydney saw me wear them and was like, oh my God. So I think I'm gonna put her in them, but they're like leopard print capris. Random vintage find. Okay, I wanna bring in the red. I'm kind of going for like a summery, or I guess spring. Hot girl picnic. I'm going for like devil bombshell in a movie. Like villainous Loki. Like the mean girl in a movie. What would she wear? That's what we're going for. I love this top. It's like a dead stock 90s random wrap top. Gosh, I have a lot of like red slinky tops. That doesn't feel right. I think let's do this one. Do you see what I'm going for? Maybe a bag. It'd be cute to do a pink bag because there's pink in it and I love pink and red together. Oh, actually a white. I have this bag, but I haven't used it yet. Is that mean? that I don't want my sister to use it. It could be cute. Mm. Maybe one of these? Maybe we do, it's so hard to pick without, it's so hard to pick without um, trying it on. Daisy's calling at the door. It's definitely gonna be a heel. In my head, I, I liked this vibe, but the reds. Hmm, is it black? And then we do black sunglasses? I don't really know what her pedicure situation is right now, so. Oh, these are cute. I forgot I had these. These are kind of cute with the capris, like hot. If we do that top.
top with it. And then we do a fun sunglass. Um, maybe these Chanel ones are like bitchy. Oh wait, actually these ones are cute and we wore them in the shoot. Sydney looks cute in them. Like, would Sydney wear these? Oh, these are cute. They're kind of like cat eye. Those could be cute on her. Or is it these? Maybe these are a little girlier. No. Wait. It's these. It was my first instinct. My sister's style always inspires me. She'll always wear things and I'm like, that's cute. <laughs> I want to wear that. <laughs> She'll wear something and then I'm inspired by it, but then we'll, I'll add my own flair. I stole these black Chanel shoes from her for, well, she actually accidentally left them at my house. They're, they were these shoes. They were these shoes, but in black. And she like was going through a phase where she hated them. That's what she brought up. <laughs> She was going through a phase where she hated them and I just like forgot to tell her that they were at my house and then one day she was in my closet and she's like, dude, that's where my shoes are. I actually, one time she borrowed this dress from me, okay? Wore it to a concert, went out to her, went out that night, spent the night at her friend's house, left the dress at her friend's house. Like three months later, I'm shopping at Wasteland and I see the fucking dress at Wasteland and I'm, I send her a picture and I was like, how could you do this? Are you fucking kidding me? I've been asking you where that dress is. She's like, I didn't do that. I didn't do it. Uh, we got to the bottom of it and it was her friend that donated the dress. But still, like, be responsible. I knew it was mine because I was like, how many dresses say milk, vanilla, sugar, chocolate shake? Like, it's a rare one. I was gonna like, be funny and pick out something kind of mean, but I feel like she would actually wear this right now. This is like up her alley. Could it be cute to be? Don't you, do you see the vision? It looks pretty cute. We'll see what it looks like on. I am thinking I should add some accessories. And I feel like Sydney is going through a really big earring phase, so these could be cute. I wish I had pearl earrings, but unfortunately I don't. I think it's gonna be these. And then I'm generously letting her borrow my prized possession, my Cartier watch. My God, we're literally wearing the same outfit. All three of us. No way, are... all of us, all four. So what's the best way to do this? Should, are we each gonna put on the outfits? Yeah, I think we should each put them on and then close our eyes and, and then we'll stand, stand in front, in front of, of each other, other and be like, okay, okay. We're gonna go get dressed in the outfits we picked out for each other and do the big reveal, huge reveal. Okay. Or vibe, right? I did it based off of like whatever I wanted. Oh, okay, cool. What? I'm having a hard time because I couldn't try it on picking, finalizing the shoe. Sorry. This is my purse. No, it's mine, you have it too. Okay. Every time. Hey. <laughs> There's that bird. Of course. <gasps> okay, things are looking good. I'm opening. Oh my God, these are so cute. There's nothing like a good Manolo. Oh my God, these are so cute. I definitely influenced Sydney in her real, real addiction. Oh my God, we love polka dots. Oh, this is so cute. This is so Sydney. This is like her new vibe. I would wear this. Oh, oh my God, so Sydney. Did I not tell you she loves earrings? Okay, I'm gonna put on <laughs> Sydney cosplay. Wow, it goes cute with the case. Yay! One, two, two three. three. Oh my god! Wait, you look Wait, so you look cute. really cute!
Oh my god, that's cute. Wait, I kind of tore. You should have this on that wrist though. Oh, well, what if I switch this? Okay. Oh my god, wait, oh, summer that vibes. That cute on you. you this top fits you really good. <gasps> I look like we you. You did good. Yeah, I look like you. You look like me. We look cute. I knew those glasses would look good on you. <laughs> and I'm glad I chose those shoes. Yeah, these are cute. They're a little uh, hard to walk in, but it's fine. Oh, you look like me. <laughs> I look like Cindy. People keep saying we look more and more alike as we've gotten older. As we've gotten older. I wish maybe that these were pearls, but it's okay. That's okay. So I'm Sydney. <laughs> and I'm Devin. Like, I would How would I pose for an Instagram pic like You'd be like... Give us Devin. Devin be like... That's, what you That's how it does. Close your eyes and you're gonna point to whoever you think. Who is more of the angel? <laughs> Who's more of the devil? <laughs> <laughs> Who takes longer to get dressed in the morning? Easy answer. <laughs> Who spends more time shopping? <laughs> Questions. <laughs> I didn't think it'd go that fast. <laughs> Who spends more money on clothes? Duke! Yeah. yeah Will you Duke come asked. here? Yeah. Special guest yeah. questionnaire. Oh, Will you Mike, Mike. think of questions to ask like... This wait, so you guys chose out the three. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Is a more well-behaved child? <laughs> Mom said when she gave birth to me that it was like looking at an angel. Mom said I didn't even make a noise when I was born. <laughs> yeah. this is more look. likely to get Who got a their grace? impromptu tattoo. And then you get it removed. <laughs> <laughs> Who pulls more pranks? <laughs> Thank you for watching. Our new devil angel cases are available now. Are you a devil or are you an angel? <laughs> or both. Your case will tell. Bye.